How do you explain what Baker Mayfield has been able to do here, when, and and yet the the fans still aren't with him? Although I sense this week is a little better for for the grading of uh, Baker Mayfield. But what what is it about him that the people are are not buying uh, buying in yet? Well, I just think it's there's it, still the the feeling that last year was such an awful year for him. Um, you know, coming off that that short uh, cameo cameo is short. Uh, coming off that cameo first season where he had five or six quick games, looked good, improved the team. Everybody had such high expectations, and he came back. and I don't think he was in shape, and I think he he thought it was going to be easy. And I think he has that kind of that attitude that that he thought he had arrived already. And I think people have, have are bristling against that attitude still. Um, what do you expect? I think trying to clean a house that seats that that seats uh, seventy eight thousand people. What's it's, that? He's he's got a house where seventy eight thousand people live. It's got to wear and tear on him. Yeah, right. He, uh, you know, but I think what what they're seeing now is a. a, a is a guy who can manage games and do more than that, but, but, but a guy who isn't going to turn the ball over and do crazy things. And I think for a while there that you, you didn't know if he was going to just start flinging it and throwing it hot. He's high and wide. And and I think he's shown that he's more of a professional quarterback right now than he was at any time since he came into the league. I'm hearing words like you just used that uh, uh, he manages the game. That's not a bad thing. If your team is good, no, I think it takes a, some. It, it it makes you sub, subvert your ego a little bit. It makes you it makes you say, okay, I'm doing this for the good of the team. I don't care if if I'm throwing it 30 times a game, you know. Um, and I and I think he, the way he came into the league, you wondered if he could ever be that kind of quarterback. I mean, they I think they had asked the same questions about Josh Allen coming into the league. He was kind of a gunslinger and big arm and he was he's going to try to fit it into every you know s- small window that, that he was presented with and i think it's a natural thing that these young guys realize that you know this is a really good this is a really good league here there's some really great athletes on defense and they can make you look silly at times so I'm, i think he's really grown as a as a quarterback his arm has always been good and he's let's face it he's benefiting from being with a uh, a smart offensive coach who's putting him in good positions and he's gotten used to an offense for once. And we think uh, over the next three, four or five years that this coach and quarterback ought to be able to grow together like the best quarterbacks and coaches in the league always have. 